Hi guys, today I'm going to show you how to bypass the Google account uh, password. If you forget, if it happens that you forget your password or you can't remember. So what you have to do, do hard reset to the phone. And by the way, this one is ZTE Grand X Max 2 for Cricut uh, Wireless. If the same phone for any company, it's going to work this method. So first of all, do a hard reset. And then the first page you're gonna see is this one. We're gonna just put two fingers on the screen and then keep holding. We're gonna e enable the accessibility Continue mode. Continue touching the screen until you hear a beep to enable accessibility mode. Accessibility mode, there accessibility you go. tutorial. We're gonna press twice. By Exit. Touch is turned on. You can touch the screen to learn. Exit button. Twice. Welcome. U shape. Application okay, info. there you go. We go back to we go to Google search. Google search. Okay. On this moment, uh, I'm gonna see to um, disable the accessibility mode. Let me see if I remember. Is it two volumes up and down? As you see, guys, I tried to disable the accessibility mode. It didn't go through, but it's okay. We still can walk. Uh, you know, go uh, through the same process. You just go right here. Google app. And then we're gonna no thanks. No thanks. The Google app uses your location to improve your search experience. You can try change app preferences browser. in your B. Show B deleted. Show R. Showing four suggestions. Okay, once we start just uh, the letter B and R, uh, you're gonna see this logo on the bottom, which is browser. We're gonna click on that one. Open browser. Double click. Allow browser. Click on allow. Allow button. Double click. Browser. Browser. There you go. We're on Google right now. Uh, we're gonna type google.com. Edit box. HTTP colon slash slash www.google.com. Google. Okay. okay. On once you open the google.com uh, browser, we're gonna just go to the search, search bar list. and we're gonna write task. Search drop. End. 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 Task. End. Space. End. D. PC and, and, and. space and APK right here. Test DPC APK. Test DPC APK. Okay. Google search. If you want to scroll down, package. we have to do two fingers. There you go. November. No. November. November. No. November 10th. November 10th, 2015, 317 downloads, 0 0.78 megabytes. Okay, so we're gonna go to this website. I think it's November gonna be the first one. Package, com .app. November, November 10th, 2015. And package, we're gonna try com to download this app. Test 1 million eight hundred five thousand three hundred seven. November 10th, 2015. Package, com .app samples Test 1 million eight hundred five thousand three hundred seventeen downloads. 0 okay, 0.78 right megabytes. Here, 819 thousand two hundred twenty. November, November 10th, 2015. Package, com .app six bytes. Min Android okay, 5.0. We're gonna scroll down with two finger on the screen until we see click here. Com .app samples .test 1 million eight hundred five thousand three hundred seventeen downloads. 0 0.78 megabytes. 819,226 okay, bytes. Min when Android it's load, we're gonna go ahead and click period. on the November 10th, 2015 package. Com .app samples .test 1 million eight hundred five thousand three hundred seventeen downloads. 0 0.78 your download is starting your your download is starting three period the current page scale was saved okay so we're just gonna wait until it's loading if sometimes well uh, some pop-ups will turn will pop up on your phone so you don't have to worry about that just go back so you can be on this main page which is this one it's the www.apkmirror.com forward slash apk Edit box http colon slash slash w and this one we're gonna bottom click on underscore cd two. underscore wind bottom underscore cd underscore windows bottom bottom underscore bottom underscore cd underscore okay so once we click on the number two twice you're gonna see this a little page will pop up. We're gonna click on new window. New window. Okay, once we get to this page, we're just gonna go back on this arrow. Back. Bottom up. Exit. Cancel. Okay. 
Okay, button. Click on OK. Welcome. And then now the U shape again. Overview. There you Application go. Info. And then we're going to go to the Shop. Google search. Google search. We're going to type app. file. F I L Sh E. Showing four suggestions. There you go. Open we're file manager. File manager. File manager. And go to the app, as you see right Apps here. Apps 2. Apps 2. File manager. Okay. Showing items 1 to 2 and of 2. And now we're going to install that program that we loaded before. Just go double click. Cup. Alert install block settings. for security. Your phone is set to block installation mm -hmm. of apps obtained We're from click on settings. settings button. And security. Go to two hands, two fingers. We're going to enable the announcers. Unknown source. Alert your okay button. Press OK. Security. Showing item 6 to 16 of 22. Okay, from here we're gonna just uh, go back. Back. File manager. And we're Showing gonna try to install it again. Cup. Package installer. And go all the way down to install. Install button. Package installer. Google Accept. Play Store. Accept. Package installer. And we're just gonna wait until it's installing. Open. Open button. Open but test DPC. We're gonna choose the bottom option, set up device owner. Not checked. Set up device and owner. Click on checked. Set up. Set up button. Set up your device. Start setup. Set up button. Just Alert follow your administrator the steps. has the ability choose to monitor okay. and manage setting. Okay, but set up your device. Showing progress. Setting the device owner. Set up your device. Showing progress. Device unlocked. File manager. Okay. Set up phone. Just a sec. Just a sec. And this option it won't go back, so we're just gonna click on the power button. Again. Lock screen. We're just gonna scroll Cup. down. Quick settings. There you go. With two fingers, we slide it. Go to the option tab. Settings. Device unlocked. There settings. you go. And then scroll down with two fingers. All the way to accessibility mode, so we can disable it. There accessibility accessibility showing items one talk, talk back, back on talk We're back just gonna go ahead on. and then Switch. disable on. It. alerts okay, okay button. double click and there you go we get rid of this option after this we're gonna scroll all the way down to about phone click on it go to build number let's see right here Yes, you just click um, as like five times and then you're gonna see you are now developer option. We're gonna go back to developer option now we can see it. Click on it. Okay, on this option we're gonna go to Stay awake, we're gonna enable it. Go to OEM unlocking, click yes, enable. Then go to USB debugging, okay. And then we're gonna go back. And then back up and reset. Factory data reset, all the way to reset the phone. So everything that you have the phone, it will be erased and erase everything
Okay, so when it's reset, you're gonna see this uh, screen again. We're gonna go next. Choose the Wi-Fi that you have. On my case, I'm gonna put my password. Then we're just gonna go next. Just click. No tanks. Go next. Skip. Now we did give us the option to skip if we don't want to put the email. Skip. Skip. If you want to put your name, you can. Just going to go next. Not now. Next. Uh, I don't need it. No password for me. Skip. Skip anyway. On oh, next. Scroll down. Go next. Uh, I agree. Yes. And boom. There you go. You get your phone back and you can use it again. Uh, if you do have any question, please comment on the video below. And thank you again. Please subscribe to our channel to get the new uh, videos. And thank you and give us a thumbs up.